I was at the, you know, the ambassadorial residence, I, the, the residence of the head of the U.S. Embassy in Cuba, and um, I watched the Marines raise the flag on the flagpole, and the flag hasn't flown there in 54 years, and I mean, I've said this before, it isn't like I walk by every American flag and salute when I pass by, but it was a very moving moment. I mean, it was um, a sign of this new relationship, and I was proud of my country for, uh, you know, moving forward in a constructive way in its relationship with Cuba. Um, uh, there were people in the Cuban-American business community who were there. Uh, there were a whole range of Cubans there from people in and close to the dissident community through the church and others. And then, you know, there were U.S. diplomats. There were friends and colleagues of mine who worked on changing U.S. policy. Kind of all of us standing there together and watching the flag be lifted. And then along with, you know, our leading kind of allies in the Congress itself. So to see them all and to all of us be there together uh, after years of effort to see our policy change and see it sort of that change confirmed because they're lifting the flag up the pole was really, it was great. So in December, after 18 months of secret talks, the, the president and Raul Castro spoke personally on the phone and then both presidents made announcements the next day announcing, announcing their intention to normalize relations. This marked the beginning, marked the end of one era in that process and the beginning of another. This was symbolic in that it marked the fact that diplomatic relations had been restored on both sides and they're normal enough that we are exchanging chiefs of mission, we are opening embassies, we're raising the flag on both sides. The Cuban flag is flying here and the American flag is fly flying there. You can say, oh, that's merely symbolic, but it is an important marker that, of the progress that's been made. It's also the beginning of the next era, and the next era is when we start to discuss the issues we have in common and the issues that divide us. And clearly, there's gonna be relatively quick progress on some of the things we have in common, right? We're gonna see progress on law enforcement, we're gonna see progress on environmental cooperation, we're gonna see progress on civil aviation. There's a bunch of things like that that are in the mutual interest of both countries and are clearly going to move ahead.